Not yet. It has about uh, eight seconds to ready. Oh, it's like good. Oh, no, no, can't help. We're going to get you to try You guys are up for live. Yeah, I know. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So, uh, Charles is uh, typing right now, so we can see ourselves also in the live streaming room. Hi, everybody. So, Hi, so today's live streaming is about uh, how to migrate. DLive from Lino blockchain to um, BitTorrent and the Tron blockchain. So today uh, we will give you guys a uh, very detailed like a solution and also the time milestone for like everything uh, we will do. Um, so first of all, um, Charles will uh, Charles is the uh, CEO of DLive. He will give you uh, more like the brave introduction and also how we're gonna do this and I will uh, give you a little bit hint about our future plan. So uh, let's get start uh, from from Charles. Okay. Um, hi everyone. Um, as we mentioned in the previous announcement, so um, today Lino uh, Lino Foundation Lino Project Foundation they announced that uh, they released a new announcement that uh, they will officially discontinue the support of the Lino blockchain as of. 12 a.m. Uh, April 15th, 2020, which we call it a, a, a cutoff time. So following that time, the Lino blockchain will no longer be live. Lino tokens will no longer be transferable and have any value or utility. So to ensure uh, a smooth transition uh, for DLab users who hold Lino, they continue to use their token through the cutoff time. Uh, however, if you are located in the United States, you're a resident in the United States, uh, you can, the DLive will uh, accept Lino for, uh, for, for the Lemon on the Lino, uh, on the DLive platform. So Lemon, as we all know, Lemon is an in-platform fixed value currency and be only used in DLive and can be only used to make purchases and, and donate, uh, donate to your favorite content creators. So, you can use your Lino to, to purchase Lemon on, on DLive. And the minimum Lino uh, to convert is just one Lino. And one Lino equal to one Lemon rate. And this option is actually available now in uh, the Lino wallet. You guys can check the uh, account.lino.network account and just go ahead to do that. So, however, if you are a streamer and you would like to get paid, uh, uh, using the get pay function on DLive for your lemons, you, you would need to meet a certain minimum requirements for, for all users of DLive. For example, you need to verify your, your email, you need to have, uh, go through the KYC process, you need to have stream history on DLive. Uh, that's for, for, for users in the United States and for United States only. And for all other countries, uh, we have partnered with BTT a BitTorrent Foundation to allow you to receive a number of uh, BTT tokens based on the number of uh, Lino tokens you hold. So to participate, uh, here's the plan you guys can see in the announcement. We, you must create an account of Blonix.com and uh, the minimum Lino to convert is one Lino. The BTT exchange rate will be based on the BTT market price of Blonix dot com at the time you choose to convert and as we mentioned we partnered with the uh, BitTorrent Foundation uh, we're willing to offer a, a 3% premium to, uh, to all you know holders who participate and um, and also uh, Blonix.com uh, is expected to list uh, BTT mid-February and your, your Lino account will require you to follow certain instructions and agree to a set of terms of conditions uh, when you do that. Uh, I think the user experience will be, will be very smooth and very friendly to you guys. It will, it will not take a lot of time for you to, to do that uh, in the wallet. And this option, 
um, available starting February 25th, 2020. So what happens to Lino blockchain and Lino, uh, Lino coin, Lino state after, after uh, April 15th? So currently all, uh, for all Lino holders, uh, the Lino blockchain validators will implement an, an upgrade that allows all, all Lino stake to be staked out in one day. This means all stakes that have been processed before this time or after this time to be staked out simply within one day. Um, and for users who wish to retain their Lino stake, they can still do it and they can still enjoy the staking rewards um, until the cutoff time, which is April 15th, uh, 12 a.m. So we strongly recommend that all DLAP users who hold Lino stay, stay out before the cutoff time. After the cutoff time, top, uh, cutoff time, the Lino blockchain and Lino coin Lino state will no longer be supported. And there is no assurance um, that Lino token can be transferred, that there's a value of functionality on the Lino blockchain after the cutoff. So uh, that's basically everything about the, uh, like instructions, how can you convert your existing Lino coins to other, uh, to, to BTT or, or Lemma. Um, Justin will, will take care of you guys. So uh, I guess Justin can talk about some future plans. Yeah, sure. Uh, first of all, um, before I, uh, I do the future plans, I just want to uh, give you guys like a brief uh, introduction about uh, BitTorrent and the Plonex. So uh, as you know, like everybody enjoy the service uh, and the protocol uh, from BitTorrent. BitTorrent is founded back to uh, 2003. So this is like one of the uh, most like longer, uh, longest standing uh, internet company even in, in the entire industry. So uh, BitTorrent introducing um, a decentralized way um, so you can P2P file sharing uh, your files basically in your computer. So a lot of the people these days uh, use BitTorrent protocol, uh, not only like uh, friend, you, you, me, and all of, of our friends, but also um, Blizzard, um, Facebook, Amazon, and lots of the large companies, they also use the uh, BitTorrent as a protocol to transfer their files. Um, BitTorrent, um, the company, uh, we invented the BitTorrent protocol. And at the same time, we committed to developing uh, the best uh, clients for um, BitTorrent protocol. Uh, for example, uh, BitTorrent clients, uh, uTorrent, uh, and also um, it's available in all platform, uh, Android, uh, uh, Mac, uh, and also um, uh, Windows. Uh, and of course, everybody know uh, our biggest user base is in uh, Windows Classic. Uh, is called uh, uTorrent Classic. Um, so the whole user base of uh, BitTorrent is over one billion, and we have over one hundred million uh, monthly active users uh, across the globe uh, in one hundred and thirty-eight countries. So uh, it's a very uh, large user base uh, across the world. Um, in 2018, uh, Tron Foundation, uh, we acquired BitTorrent. At the same time, we introduced uh, BitTorrent into the blockchain world. So that's why we have uh, the new um, project called BitTorrent Speed, uh, BTFS. So um, BitTorrent Speed is just a project for people to spend BTT, uh, this is the token, and also everybody uh, except United States users will convert their Lino to BTT. Uh, so I will introduce some user case of the BTT. So first of all, um, BTT can use to um, uh, accelerate your download speed. Uh, if you spend BTT, uh, you can accelerate your download speed with um, um, three times or even four times it's uh, faster than uh, what, what you do before. And you can uh, seed in to earn BTT. Uh, we already get somebody like earn BTT to, uh, to get uh, like a hundred bucks like, like per week. So, um, so we will roll out these features 
to all our existing uh, user base uh, of the uh, BitTorrent users in Q1. So after Q1, uh, we will get more than 100 million active users uh, using BitTorrent Speed, these features. So I, I, uh, as uh, Charles introduced, um, in February 15th, you can convert your Lino. Um, oh, actually available now. Oh, convert Lino to Lemon. Oh, oh, I mean the BTT. The BTT, oh yeah, the yeah. NLP February. NLP. Yeah, end of February, so you can convert them, so, and then you can try out BitTorrent uh, speed and how it accelerates uh, your downloading. Uh, and at the same time, we will introduce uh, BTFS, actually the same day today, uh, using BTT to buy um, the storage. Uh, we haven't like, do uh, a massive marketing yet because we want the network to be stable and uh, uh, um, and then we can introduce to the to all our audience. But actually, it's introduced today, so you can use BTT to buy storage um, plans um, in the BTFS network. So BTFS network is also a decentralized uh, network uh, for storage. So you can storage your files, your videos, all, 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 all of our, your um, um, files in the distributed network. Distributed network have several advantage. First of all, it's so much cheaper than like a Google Drive, like Dropbox and the other like storage provider. Uh, it's like six BTT for like per megabytes right now. So. Uh, if you check the BTT price, we will, you will know like each BTT is, the price is very cheap. So six BTT for per megabytes uh, means like very, I mean, almost nothing. And also um, um, the same time uh, is censorship resistance. So no one can delete your content at all. So right now, you know uh, about the crypto purge in YouTube, YouTube suddenly deleted lots of the uh, crypto influencer files on YouTube, right, with, with, just with the click, right? And of course, if your videos or files get reported in Google or like Dropbox, they can delete your content because they are the hoster, you know, they can delete whenever they want. But uh, even we are the founder of BTFS, we can't delete uh, anybody's files because this is distributed stored in um, lots of the people's computer. So it's impossible to be deleted. It's just like Tron blockchain. Even I'm the founder of Tron, I can't like block, if you make transaction on Tron blockchain, I, I can't block them, right? It's just like Bitcoin. So even Santoshi uh, come back, he, he can't block like everybody's uh, transaction or uh, take your money from your wallet, right? If you get your key, you control your assets. So for the BTFS, it's the same. So that's why we collaborate with DLive to make all of your video uh, available on BTFS, which means censorship resistance. And the same time is super safe. Your content is safe. Nobody can delete your content. So it will stay there forever as long as you want, right? Uh, so this is about uh, 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 BitTorrent. Um, and uh, also, uh, we, we already introduced the DLive on all of our channels, and we will go to a deeper uh, integration in the future. So right now, if you download uTorrent on Android, uh, Google Play, you can already find out the DLive uh, in, in, in uTorrent. But uh, in this quarter, we will introduce the web version of the DLive into, uh, integration into uh, uTorrent. Uh, which means there will be uh, a tens of the millions of the users come to um, the DLive platform. And at the same time, we also have um, Tron TV integration. So uh, lots of the DLive contents will be available on Tron TV and the old um, BitTorrent platform. So, and, and you will also see lots of the BitTorrent users come to uh, DLive in the web, web web version. So you will see lots of the user come. Uh, um, it's a benefit for, for all of our customers. 
yeah, exactly. So for our influencer, uh, they will see uh, much more like audience come on board and also um, they will find out their contents available uh, in many platforms. So, um, so this is the integration uh, between the DLive and uh, um, uh, 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 BitTorrent. Because right now DLive only have 4 million um, uh, active users, uh, 5 million active users. Um, there's a lot of the room to grow because BitTorrent have 100 million active users. So, so we are very excited. We can integrate these two ecosystems together and also bring the BitTorrent users more excitement. Uh, so this is about like BitTorrent. So for those of you uh, who needed to convert your Lino to BTT in Polonix platform, I would like to uh, also give you guys a little bit introduce about Polonix. So um, Polonix is founded in 2014. The um, Polonix is the only like OG crypto uh, exchange right now is still available in our industry. You know, this is the uh, fascinating part of uh, crypto. Most of the cryptocurrency uh, exchange got bankrupt. I mean, especially when they founded before like 2014, most of them got bankrupt, either got hacked by the hackers or the founders just run away with the money, you know. <laughs> that that sometimes happens in crypto world. It's hard to believe, but uh, it happens. Recently, even like a Canadian exchange, the founder is dead. I mean, founded in, in India. Uh, we don't know if whether he, he is re, uh, he, he's dead already, but he said he's dead. So, um, so the money is all gone. So, you know, so that's why, I mean, the com competition in the, Crypto exchange is uh, is uh, is uh, 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 is very serious. So, but Poloniex is the only winner in this competition. Poloniex is founded in 2014. Right now it's 2009, uh, 2020. Six six years pass. You know, this is like 60 years in crypto world. So this is the only available. OG exchange in the crypto world, and uh, Poloniex is the own is the first exchange to support Ethereum, Ethereum Classic in the whole industry. If you you guys know like Ethereum, Ethereum is one of the right now the popular most popular uh, cryptocurrency in in the world. Uh, um, Poloniex is the first one to support them, and the Poloniex is like the first one to supports lots of the cryptocurrency. So this means safety, reliable, like, like, like also it's an OG exchange. So lots of the OGs in the crypto, they always use Blonix. Uh, and also this is the one of the most uh, uh, liquidity uh, uh, exchange in the world as well. So, so that's why we are so exciting. We can collaborate with uh, Blonix to make the uh, Polonix available for everybody in the world. And also at the same time, if you go to tryoutpolonix.com, you will find out the registration process is so simple. It's only take you two minutes to register accounts, which is not available in most of the exchange. If you right now want to get an account in Coinbase, it's take you like a day or something, because you need to do the, all the KYC, all the, for the approval, uh, it's got, gonna cost you a lot of the time. But for, uh, for the uh, Plonix, it's only take you two minutes, you can get the registration and start trading. So uh, this is about Plonix. Uh, and uh, uh, so I will give you uh, uh, our like future plan, change the live platform after April 15th. Um, so first of all, uh, lemons will remain on the D Live, and the transaction will be uh, recorded uh, on the Tron blockchain. That's the first thing. The second thing is in place of the Lino accounts and wallet to check balance for the Linos and the um, lemons. Uh, users will now have D Live wallet to check balance for lemons and the BTT. The new uh, DLive wallet will support OTRC20 tokens, including BTT. 
Uh, and the BTT will have the same staking feature with Lino. So you can stake in the D BTT on DLive to vote for DLive features. And the same time receive on uh, DLive consumption rewards. As you know, uh, um, the, the DLive community will take 99% of the consumption of the tipping and reward all the staking holders in BTT. Uh, fifth is BTFS will be integrated to the DLive and allow all the um, past, uh, longer past um, broadcast storage duration. So you can see your um, broadcast in the future, uh, even you end it, the, the live streaming. I hope uh, you are ready because the BitTorrent engine is just getting warm up. Yeah, I guess that's pretty much everything about this, uh, about the announcement and some uh, future plans. And I hope you have a better understanding, uh, better ideas about how uh, uh, BitTorrent ecosystem, Tron ecosystem look like. And yeah. Um, Maybe we'll take two questions. We can take some questions from the Yeah, we can take two questions from the live channel. So we, uh, we see the questions here. Somebody asked about like uh, uh, if we have some new partners, new DLive partners. Uh, so uh, so definitely after the DLive uh, 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 collaboration with SpeedHorn, we are not only gonna introduce more traffic into the DLive ecosystem, uh, we will also um, uh, increase our investment uh, in uh, um, all the DLive platform. So we, you will see uh, we will have more marketing campaigns uh, we will have more uh, user acquisition uh, uh, um, uh, on DLive. So yeah, and also you will see more influencer, like uh, more uh, streamers and the more content creator active on DLive platform. When is the Turkish streaming? Oh yeah, we're gonna, yeah. Usually we after the English stream, oh. our Turkish community, our head of community, oh. host the Turkish stream. Yeah, sure. Uh, why haven't non-US users got the option to convert to lemons? Maybe you you can yeah. uh, respond this question. Yeah. So yeah, for for US users, well, first of all. Uh, BTT will be, first of all, BTT will be similar to Lino. It will be like uh, the, the platform currency that have used in the entire DLive and the BTT ecosystem. So uh, it is important for our users to hold BTT. And in, uh, as a BTT token holder, they can also enjoy a lot of exclusive benefits of DLive. Um, so that's that's actually one reason, and we actually wanted to uh, to introduce a BTT token, allow our users to uh, give all of our users an option to choose a BTT a token. However, due to the regulation, due to some legal concerns uh, uh, for US users, we can only provide them an option. So uh, for for BTT uh, after they, they they claim their BTT, they can do whatever. They can they can trade it um, in the future. We'll also you know support donate with BTT on D Live and uh, maybe also uh, use your BTT to directly purchase lemon. Um, yeah, that's pretty much the reason why we're doing this. Yeah, you um, um, if you can check on like uh, Binance right now. Um, BTT is this city in Binance. If you check on Binance. Uh, you you will find out BTT is actually a very uh, liquidative uh, asset in the crypto world. Where do do you go to buy storage? Uh, so uh, you can go to the Twitter to follow my tweet uh, called Justin Sound Trump. So I will uh, first uh, like uh, make announcement in my Twitter. Uh, so. Uh, once the BTFS is available uh, on, on, on the internet, I will uh, announce it in my Twitter. And 
and I guess D Live will be the first to use case for this. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Maybe one more, one more question. One more question. What percentage is taken from lemons themselves? Yeah, it's like um, currently um, DLab as a platform, we do not take any cuts, but um, the uh, the features we design is nine point nine uh nine ninety point one percent of all the consumptions like which includes uh uh tips and subscri paid subscriptions will all go directly goes directly to our content creators and the rest of nine point nine percent will be used to, to distribute it uh, and reward to all reward all of our uh, BTT stakeholders of the life yeah exactly so, yeah. That's the we, we don't take as a platform we do not take cut from uh, from from our users from consumptions. Yeah. Okay. I cool. Guess, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. See you next time. See you next. I guess. See next you time, next time. Uh, Justin will probably play a game. With yeah. Our, yeah. Sure. With totally. Our yeah. Totally. I, I'm a gamer too. Yeah. See you. See you. All. Thank you. Thank you.